What's going on, everybody? So I'm back to do a uh, comic book haul. These are going to be two comics that were on my pull list at my local comic book shop. Uh, while I was there, picked up a couple of bundles that they had put together. And then I uh, also got a eBay um, purchase. So let's just get right into it with my pull list. Uh, I have Batman Beyond 23 came in. Really, really like this uh, Dave Johnson cover. This is a um, variant cover. Really, really dig that. Uh, the inside art is fantastic as well. So, I really enjoyed this uh, Batman Beyond. Sorry. When the you buy these, or uh, my comic book shop comes with these that are resellable. But if you're not careful, you'll get it stuck to your comics. And the next thing you know, you got a tear. So I have to be a little more careful when I take these out to show them. But uh, when I show them, it has a pretty pretty bad glare. I'm just going to leave this in just to save a hassle. But let's see if I can turn this. This is the new Punisher volume um, that's just starting. So you just had... Uh, the Punisher, who had War Machine's armor. Um, you've got uh, Punisher as Cosmic Ghost Rider. Neither one of those really appealed to me. I do enjoy and I do collect all the Punisher titles, but I'm glad to see that they're getting back to uh, where Punisher, in my opinion, needs to be. He needs to be kind of that anti-hero Vigilante on the street, just, you know, there's two storylines uh, that work, in my opinion, very, very well for Punisher. And I'm not trying to box him in and say this is the only thing he ever needs to be. But as the, the, the street vigilante getting justice uh, because of what happened to his family or the backstory of him being in uh, Vietnam, um, I think both of those uh, scenarios work very, very well with his character. And like I said, Garth Ennis can write The Punisher uh, unlike anyone else. Uh, this is going to be done by Rosenberg, so I'm not very familiar, but I am excited to see uh, what they do with The Punisher in this new volume. So I'm just glad they're not trying to superhero him up, you know. All right, they had a couple of bundles at my comic shop, and they had buy one, get one free on the bundles. So I picked up two bundles. Uh, the first one uh, is the um, 2016, I believe. I'm trying to, I saw a date on one of these. Yeah, 2016 Gamora uh, series that they put out. Tells the backstory of Gamora as an assassin. I've heard a couple people talk about this series, uh, so I wanted to pick it up because she is an interesting character, uh, and she's playing a huge role in the new Infinity Wars uh, that's coming out. So I wanted to get more of her backstory. So there's two. There's three. So this was a five-part, yeah, five-part limited series. All right, and so the other bundle I picked up was one of my favorite comics, Mars Attacks. This is the 2014, um, I think 2014. Yeah, 2014 uh, limited series, Mars Attacks. And um, this is number one. This is a variant. Love that cover. And then this is number two. This is the variant. This is called Mars Attack Firstborn, by the way. Uh, and then here's the regular uh, number one. Here's a really cool cover. Number two. 
I love Mars Attacks. That art to me is I've always enjoyed that. You know, the storyline's cool. You know, a little tongue in cheek with the storyline. But uh, I don't know, it's kind of like a throwback. So, and there's the last one. All right, that was from IDW 2014. All right, and I picked up on eBay, I picked up a uh, Judge Dredd Legends of the Law. This was put out by DC. I uh, can't remember what years are on these, but, um, okay, 94, so picked up uh, a lot really, really inexpensively off of eBay, so this is uh, Judge Dredd's Legends of the Law, so there's one, two, whoa, three, my favorite cover out of this series. And then fours on the back of two. Here we go. Some of these covers are so-so, but this one right there, that number three, that's the stuff right there. Look at that. I don't know who this is, but Dorman. Here's five. There's not that many in this series, so I think I've got about a little over half. I think it's like 13 or 14. Uh, number six. Number seven. Number eight. Oh, I didn't know there was another one in here. Uh, on the back of here is number 13, but I don't think it's the same series. It may be. Uh... This says Judge Dredd's Legends of the Law. This is just Judge Dredd number 13. So I don't think it's the same series. I didn't even realize I received this. So that's cool. It's like you threw in an extra. Uh, to get back to the Legends of the Law, number nine. And then he did include this in the lot. So it looks like he threw in one extra comic that I just realized I got. Uh, this is a graphic novel. This is Judge Dredd based on the um, movie, the Sylvester Stallone. Mm, movie's not that great. So, But uh, here's a graphic novel that ties in. Oh, the back's, nah, I was going to say the back's kind of cool, but not really. It's like almost like an x-ray. I'm a law. So, going to get those and some new. I've got to order some new um, sleeves for these. Uh, I have run out. All I've got is backing boards. And uh, one other thing I wanted to show. I picked up my first short box. So I thought that one was really cool. Plus it wasn't that expensive. So uh, I do like these short boxes that have art on them. I'm not very artistic myself. So, I know some people make their own or draw their own stuff on the boxes, but, uh, yeah, I prefer just to buy them with the art already on it because I suck at art. All right, that's it. That's what I got. Thanks for watching, as always. And, uh, yeah, like I say, today was new comic book day. I only got two new ones. So, I hope everyone else had uh, a lot better day if you went out to your local comic book shop. Support your local comic book shop, unless they're douches. You know, if they're good people, support them. Uh, otherwise, there's some online choices for you. Uh, my favorite being uh, my comic book shop or my comic shop. So, but, uh, and also eBay. I'm an eBay, I'm an eBay guy, man. That's how I roll. Take care, buddy. Talk to you soon. Bye,